And we're back. It's Bro League. Uh, Old Lake here. I've got my fellow favorite caster in the league. Aww. Jeff Cat. I'm here, too. We're here. This is it. Yeah, we're here. And, we... uh, oh, go ahead. I got excited. We're going to watch some uh, Siege today. Ah. Yeah, I some think Bro that's League a good idea. Siege. Is that is that the goal? I mean, I was watching football. I think this might be better. Uh, depending on the outcomes of some of the games, yes. <laughs> well, let's get into it. Like uh, normal, we're moving along. This week, we've got a matchup of Canis Lupus and Polar's Revenge. Yeah, uh, Polar's Revenge versus Canis today in the Challenger division. Both teams are 2-2 two and two on the season. Uh, Polar's with six points and Canis with one of their wins coming in OT at five points. However, Canis with a two-game win streak coming into this game. So they got a hot hand right now. All right. All right. Yeah, they knocked off the uh, what was thought to be the giants of the, the league, Los Chicos. And uh, ever since that, that big win, um, they've been rocking and rolling. Steamrolling, right? Yeah. Like a, like a freight train. Yeah, it's uh they're, they're, they've put together two really quality wins and... They're looking to get some uh, some more points and get secured into that major, the playoff spot. Which is coming. Things are heated. You better believe it, bud. <laughs> well, it's we got our team whether we like it or not. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't matter. The time is coming. It's moving forward. And again, moving forward, Kenneth Lupus, we've got Mythic, uh, Light, Wolf J, Spectos, and Coyote. Depending on where you're at, actually, it could be Coyote or Coyote. And then Polar's Revenge made up with Simon Says, Glitter Gooch, Mac D, Leonidas Mama, and Hank Cyclone. We there do will have a be couple. a couple. Oh, oh I, I was going gonna... <laughs> to. Hey, oh, hey, there you go. <laughs> it's go. been so long, like we've lost our uh, we've lost our rhythm. No, the rhythm's still there. It's just got a little bit of a new mix to it. It's like an old lawnmower where you got to crank pull it a few times before it really gets going. You know I like it when you crank pull me, Jeff. Right. It is what it is. All right. This week, they band it down to Chalet. This is going to be interesting. Uh, yeah. Had some pretty good matches on Chalet. Um, yeah. Kind of a... It's a good map for a lot of good gunfights. A lot of good choke points to hold in this one. It's it's an entertaining map to cast. Uh, and I'm interested to see what these two teams do and bring to the table. And the two subs we have um, for... The match for Canis, I think we have Blunder and T, and then we got one sub for Polars in Tiny Taco. So those are the new faces today. Spit it out, because here we are getting started, although we got some question marks in chat already. Don't worry about question marks. Did we have a little miss up here? No. Mythic says they're supposed so. to be on Yeah, defense. they're supposed to defend. Canis is defending. Now, look at this, guys. Already starting <sighs> off with a hoot. All right. Well, Polar Let's... said they picked defense. Don't stop it yet. What? What is happening? Let me pull up the map, band. All right. Let's see what happens. <sighs> Lord have mercy. The one, the one day. So, well, you know, it's been a while, Jeff. Canis should be defending as of the map ban. All right. Well, we got to go ahead and uh, let them know we're going to rehost it. That's going to go. All right. We'll be right back. <laughs> this is the who. We'll be right back. We got to rehost everything. Give us just That's a, a big old psych to you in Twitch chat. <laughs> just want to see who's watching. All right, we'll be back.
All is well. I'm sorry, I'm just oh. frustrated. No, you're we're unmuted and you are are frustrated. The Cowboys the Cowboys play at 320. Like the Cowboys play at 320. I know. We've got a time limit here, everybody. All right, we're <laughs> we're gonna do this again. All right. We're back. We're and back and better than ever. That or as it average. Can only, hey, as it ever. can only go up from here. It can also go down, Jeff. It can go down. You do not say that. I'm just going to put it out there. And the first ban of the match is Thatcher. I will say thank you so much, teams, for being, like, legitimately paying attention and not allowing it to go through. Like, they did catch it very quickly, so... Yep, Props it took to us a little for... bit to respond just because we were double checking all everything on our end, but we were here yeah. for you. 100%. One of these days, we're going to do a casters match where we don't give a f about any player. I would be interested to see who streams that one. <laughs> you know who it'll be. <laughs> I, I don't, because if it's all casters playing, who uh, like there's a lot that goes into all this. Oh, man. Actually, that would be... Uh. It'd have to be yeah. Ribo. Ribo would have to be in there because we need the color commentary. Well, he's casted before, so technically he'd be Ooh, in the cast. That's cast true. Ooh, is this, uh, see what happens. Like so we, we got it. a Thatcher Monty ban, which is odd. Uh, Kaid and Mira, which is a good ban for Chalet. A lot of holes. Was that Monty ban to, bon is that a targeted ban for Wolf J? Is it that might a... be. I didn't but you know who they didn't ban? The dreaded clash. Ugh. Nobody likes that. Yeah, but Wolf J's not playing today, so... Wait, am I confused? <laughs> hey, guys, I I'm new he... here. I haven't been here in a while. I apologize. Uh, no, you're cr he is on uh, Canis, so he must be one of the yep. subs that they needed. So, yep. Shout out to Wolf J, who couldn't make it. I did somewhat catch the C4. And there's Baby Merchant with the bets. He's got his quarter on Canis. What's your win rate so far, uh, Baby Merchant? Oh, Dirk Ooh. laying the big money. Dirk's with wow. seventy-five cents on Polars. These guys are yeah. these guys are money makers. Uh, big money going down. The Bro League is a racket. Uh, Glitter Gooch going with the six pick on to from Dokabi to Jackal. Defenders, protect your bombs from being defused by attackers. All right. What do we got going on? Pretty typical. A couple drones coming in, little drone hole. Drones tend to do that. Yep. <laughs> Let's follow these guys. Let's see what's going on in the adventures of the drone. All right. Tiny tacos. Having a rough time getting through that snow. Pretty <laughs> yeah, thick well, this time of year. Absolutely. Winter is coming, uh, as the Game of Thrones would say. No bandit trick here. Light's just going to lay those bandit charges down on garage. DV8's going to get some ADSs on main stairs. Light looked to be roaming with some bandit play. Yeah, I got the hatch. He's grabbing hatches. Okay, okay. Smart move. I yeah. haven't played this game in two months, guys. It's been <laughs> lovely. My it's life has while. been so much less stressful. <laughs> Stop airing your dirty laundry, Jeff. This is supposed to be uh, positive. It is positive. That is positive. I just talked about how great my life was. See how you brought Siege to make it negative again? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got four people downstairs. We got somebody on Rome. Mythic sitting upstairs. Actually, not a surprise that Mythic's on Rome. Pretty yeah, difficult. Mythic is pretty deadly on the Rome, and he's got a good operator for the Rome. Yeah, Does get droned he, out there, though. Yeah, they are aware of he's at, where he's at. You can see the stuff happening. Yeah, he's about to get in a gunfight here with Taco. I think in so. In this library hold. Taco's already jumped in. Ooh, Illusion trap. Legion Let's on him. Know. A little pre-fire on that action. Oh, oh, he gets him down, but he's got impact. somebody to his right. Simon with a great trade though. Good positioning there for Polars. And Mythic does not get the impact kill. So nope. Simon's gonna get to get this revive off. Absolutely. Oh, actually, Glitter. Up. Glitter Gooch comes in on that one, but that's actually an excellent play by them. Oh yeah, good great positioning, great timing. Simon Gets... comes to the aid of Tiny yeah, Taco. No taco left behind. No, no matter how tiny it may be. And there he <laughs> and is. There he is. Right there, showing that it's paying off, Hinks. Oh man, what is happening here? Yeah, he's uh, getting this hard breach onto yeah, we're about garage. To see it. Right there, nice Hank gets that shot. kill on light. T still inside. Hank tanks him. Tanks him. 
A Hank the Tank. Tank hangs him. <laughs> Blunder gets Glitter oh. Gooch. Yeah, Blunder with an answer on Glitter Gooch in the hallway. Little pre fire action going on. Here we go. Looks like they're about to come through. Oh. Oh, he, just can he barely not see him? I don't Soft think pink. so. Ooh, they've got some good angles right now. I gotta say, T and Blunder here, the two subs for. Uh, Ooh, but Four Tiny Taco gets Taco. him from the side. We're down to T. Uh, great timing by Taco. Oh, T runs no up. ammo! Oh, 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 with the swallow! Simon oh, misses but he a doesn't shot. come through. But Tiny Taco closes out the round for Polars, and that got super chaotic in the last seconds, Lake. <laughs> oh, but this is what Bro League is. I'm glad we're back into it. Oh my goodness. I thought that was a wrap win for Polars early, and then uh, Kane is kind of batting down the hatches there. And Ashley on the ground down. thinking, how, how? How are you still alive? Guaranteed <sighs> those words have come out of his mouth. That looked like one of those gunfights where both players just left the fight saying, I don't know how that just happened. <laughs> yeah, I, have, I may have had a mini stroke. <laughs> Take a look. At it looked like Taco. Uh, wow. Yeah, Taco with a great showing, um, which to show you how how that round could have gone such a different way. Taco was downed within the first minute of the match. Yeah. With Simon with a great flank and refrag not really a, even a refrag or a trade but helping his teammate out gets taco up revived and he goes off to get three kills to basically win the round for them absolutely never give play up by polars tacos never. like that little cat hanging on the rope you know mm-hmm the old motivational poster same op operator uh, picks four Canis on this hold. Yep. It was very close to working. Um, and if Mythic's impact nade does take out Taco after he knows he downed him, that also could have changed it. So many tiny instances where that round could have flipped on its head. It's a butterfly effect, Jeff. It is. All right, what do we got? Mythic's still downstairs. We got somebody else on the roam. It looks like Light. Light actually has proven himself on the roam in the past. He's, <laughs> yeah, he he's trades out the... Uh, they trade out Light and Mythic on the Bandit and Legion play. So Light's rolling with the Legion this go-round. Which makes sense. And I mean, he's able to throw down those the uh, his goo <laughs> mines to get good intel on where they're coming yeah, from. Yeah, it was... Mythic used the Legion play over there to hold Library last time. Absolutely. Um, almost worked out, but didn't quite get the kill and light's choosing a different kind of room spot here so <clears throat> yeah, but they're pushing a different angle mythic though is is moderately nice. on the roam that's what we call a moderate roam mr <laughs> we might be seeing something happen here yeah he's, he's coming up right behind glitter oh, oh and the oh, phone call right. is just Right Half when the phone call happens. Late. Mythic with timing. The ultimate timing and takes out Glitter Gooch with the entry frag. Works out in his favor this time. Last time the timing did not work. Yeah. Taco's already taken library. Uh, no, no opposition to take this library, though. Light is hanging out in master. He could yeah. get a late rotate on these guys over here. There we go. Simon's coming down. Ooh, Mythic's facing the other way. Well, here's Light. Light should be. He's Light's thinking pretty, about it. Pretty passive. He's thinking but here about we go. it. You don't. You don't want to go too early, and you definitely don't want to go too late. Here we go. Mythic again yep. in the action. Yeah, he's about to get a second, and there it is. Takes out Taco. That's a double for Mythic. Great patience. Absolutely. Gets himself repositioned. Ooh, back in that same angle. He's in a tough place. Going back upstairs though. Yeah, he's getting very aggressive now. He's feeling himself. There Taco he left goes. him with a triple. Mythic with the triple also takes out a drone for intel. Kyle. Oh, nice shot. Oh, my with goodness. the pistol shot. Mythic coming back down. We got one person left. MACD on the outside, but looks like Kyle was able to finish Great. it off. 
Great okay. shots there by DVA to finish off the last two of Polars, and that was a hell of a response by Canis on that round. Flawless. Mythic wasn't going to let that go down again. He says, nah, oh. nah, timing is going to go on my side. I think there's a <laughs> song about that. Uh, there's a song about everything if you look hard enough. <laughs> Yeah, three three K for Mythic and a double for Deviate makes easy work of that round two win for Canis, and we're all squared up at one one. And wouldn't you know it, like wouldn't you know it? <laughs> well, what do you say? You know, it's the old <laughs> curse of the casters. One one, one all, as they might say <laughs> in. Ten no, I don't think there's one. I... Tennis. <sighs> what is tennis? 10, 15, 30, 40, I don't know, some weird numbers. I thought they had a, a separate word for like a tie. It's, or is it? I think it's all, no. Love. Uh, yeah, that, I think that's it. Yep. Jeff, there's lots of love right here. Every time we play, there's always love. Uh, we're not playing. Oh no, it's Deuce. That. Oh, is it Deuce? Yeah. Uh, Speaking I guess of, that actually... I'll be back in about 10 minutes. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I was going to say every time we play, there's always a deuce, though. So. <laughs> All right. Upstairs hold. Yeah, upstairs, master bedroom and office. They're leaving that open. Deviate's getting some ADSs put into piano, which is a good idea. Bandit's getting charges on... Um, I don't, I can't remember what that room's called. Uh, Larium, I think. Floor. Okay. I mean, it's a pretty nice house if you think about it. It's crazy to think that this is a house. All right. A lot of money. Interesting to see where they go in on this one. A lot of, a lot of outside time. Good yeah. division. They're split up. Looks like they're gonna try to push from separate. Uh, we got light on the roam again. Sides of the map. Yeah, he's all the way down on the bottom floor. Mythic early engagement again. Hold yeah, that upstairs. library is a hot spot in Shelley. Uh, and, and he, he just, just got, got drawn out. out. You can see those shots coming in. Oh, he's about to make. A oh, this is tough. This is a tough. lot of people out there. Mythic has nowhere uh, to go. <laughs> <laughs> Still not out of the woods yet. They can see a little bit of this uh, hallway. We got some shots going and off upstairs. <laughs> He's got help above. I think T's above him. Yep. And Hank and Tiny Taco are at library. So Light's still you have holding three, steady. Yeah, three polars out main lobby front door, and you got two of them hanging out on windows and library. So oh, Mythic Max, and T are Max down outside. Mythic gets Mythic. that with a pistol. Wow. He's just playing out of his mind lately mythic's been putting in the work i do know that the man has been grinding some siege and polars already have pushed into main mythic, lobby mythic gets a switched second. off him oh the my third. god why can't i get back to him <laughs> t gets one so mythic and t are just holding down this entire ah. side of the map sorry mythic for, for missing that one dva is look now tiny joining taco the party comes in behind. and blunder gets the trade on tiny taco and my goodness, what happened? <clears throat> what happened is Mythic and T just wrecked shop on that entire side of the map. No entry possible for uh, for Polars. And that was yeah. just a, I think Mythic had a second triple in a row. <sighs> Got some help there from T and Blunder. And that's, if you kill five players, like, you're going to you win the round. <laughs> Such profound statements always come out of your mouth, Jeff. Right. Well, interesting. So they're gonna do a kitchen kitchen dining room hold. Um Canis Lupus really popping off right now. Mythic on fire. I hate to just sit there with a the camera on him, but right now if I flip off of him, we're just missing the action. So Yeah. It's the mythic show. And he's yeah, not doing it I alone. Mean, His team's pulling pinches. They're they're pushing him out. He, he's playing in the choke points and the entries, the, the hot zones on Chalet. And he, I, I don't under, 
he's very composed because he's getting pushed from main lobby and library windows but just backtrack waited for a good moment got out of there when it got too hot and popped three three kills off after getting they had the drop on him in main lobby yeah. and he was able to get out jeff you've played with me in those scenarios and every time i've been in one of those scenarios i normally yell and run down a hallway somewhere you've played with me and it gets, it's a very panicked situation we don't have composure no and this is why we're not in the pro league <laughs> Uh, one big operator here for Canis to note, um, as if they haven't been pushing with enough knowledge already, they do have Valkyrie, and that yes, could sir. give them even more intel on these flanks and entry holds. A uh, little change up here. Um, Glitter Gooch going with the IQ over the Dokubi. Uh, Dokubi hasn't really helped them out too much. The, the one no. phone call I've seen them get off was just literally just half a second too late. Too late. Yeah. So we got T upstairs, T and Light upstairs right now. Yeah, they're the roam gang up here. Mythic and T have been working tandem in tandem really well. And Light gets involved as well. Hold and steady though. Really good roamers for Canis. So holding steady though, right? Now. Very quiet. Ink moving slowly through. I see something happen here oh Getting almost like you're willing it to happen here like drone action right here oh. yeah yeah uh, this is getting very close hanks already got control of west main being close, very right there. patient and he takes what a him shot down. hank what with a another flick. great shot he's got company above though yeah it's gonna be tough Canis Stopping is Simon's very... down. Mythic gets that kill. T's down from the Blunder outside. Gets... Blunder takes out Taco and Glitter Gooch takes out T. So we're at a 3v3 now, just like that. Things happen quick. This vertical control, Canis has done so well with it. As you Mythic. see, Mythic barely missing some shots there. Macti's going to be stuck in that corner. Yeah, Macti has nowhere to go and he's got a sliver of health. Rook's got plates. And full health. It's gonna be yeah, a tough. He's not one. gonna be able to peek at it. Uh, he does have the right gun to oh. one off. Mythic. He does get close. All right, Mac D's out. Light takes on Glitter Gooch. We're down to Mac yeah. D and Cyclone. Cyclone gets him. Oh, that was right there. Oh, Mythic takes him out. He only had to brush him with one of those bullets though on that low health, and it's all up to Hank. He's got a drone. It does get taken out. I gotta tell you, like this vertical control so so far. Nice shot by Hank. Hank is feeling himself. Triple kill for Hank. It's a one v one. Well, he heard him shoot his drone, I believe. Plant's going down, so now he's gonna have to push. Oh, and Hank pushes it with a four K. Oh, baby! Talk about true to your name comes in like a cyclone at the end and just kills it. Oh my goodness, Hank. Just filthy round by Hank right there. Can't even complain right there. Four kills oh. out of his five in that last round. Two. What is it, Nothing Jeff? Nothing like a... Even it up that? again? Yeah, we are right back there. <laughs> two to two. Hell of a round by Hank right there. A uh, little slow start to the match, but nothing like a good old 4K clutch to get your... Get your momentum back. Get your blood pumping. Got the plant, too. I mean, he was just a one-man show. Kind of remind <laughs> well, me of that, that guy that walks around with the, the drums on his back and the drums on his front, and he's got a harmonica. Yeah, and he's, just that's him right there. Trash cans. <laughs> just all over the place. You know, uh, one, one good... Um, I think instance in that round, Mac D had Mythic tied up a lot. He did on that upstairs hold. He didn't get the kill, but he kept Mythic in one spot for such a long time. Not getting a kill doesn't mean you didn't win that. We've oh, talked no, about that God. in the past, where you hold somebody up, you know, especially where was Clubhouse, right? <laughs> where mm -hmm. you sit them in that in garage for so long that they don't really get to make a move, and yeah. in this case, it's the reverse. You held Mythic up for so long that you 
He wasn't out on the roam. He wasn't doing the thing that Mythic has been doing. Yeah, it, it gave it gave Polars, and I think Hank was the one to take him out. I could be wrong, but it gave him enough time to get some bodies up there and take Mythic out, and that opened the door for Hank to push OBJ and get the plant down and clutch that out. Hank just nutty in that round four win. Can't complain about it. <clears throat> Looks like a heavy uh, trench push here for uh, Polar. Missing somebody. Uh, there he is. Yeah, they're they're all over there. Uh, light again upstairs for Canis. They are very heavy on the vertical play. Yep. Any Tucko already inside. Blunder hanging out in 90 again. Definitely has the call outs and the intel to the rest of the team. Like, hey guys, we're getting a heavy push over here in trench. Good job by Taco taking that out. He's gonna get that bandit on that wall, so they're gonna blow that nice yeah. shot by Myth. Goodness gracious. Stop it. Hank, Hank takes out two. back. We can't go wrong with Hank and Here Mythic. Here we go. Right now, this is this. Hank and Mythic uh, head to head. <laughs> oh, 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 Hank wait. takes it down. Simon also takes out Lake, so numbers God. heavily in Polar's favor. Taco oh, takes out Blunder. We're down to four to one in just <laughs> such a short amount of time. Nice oh, shot by Kyo, it. but is he going to be able to get out with the oh, double kill? Oh, my God. <laughs> Plants down though, so now Deviate has to breach in his bag of tricks here. <laughs> one health, two v one. Plant down. What do you say? Uh, I think the option. I mean, <laughs> it, it's not in his favor. Call that's order. for sure. Oh, but that's gonna help oh, he quite gets a bit. One. Oh! <laughs> oh! Hank finishes it off. Hank Good with effort, the patience though. and another 3k for Hank and the plant. I man, if Hank can keep this pace, my goodness, he, he man. just flipped a switch in round oh, four. Hold on a second, there he is. What? Uh, glitter goose was taking a little while to load in. Oh. I was gonna gotcha. deposit if I needed to. What a what a shootout though, and to get the Hank Mythic shootout right there that was pretty good that was both leaders of this match so far i mean look at the kills eight for hank and nine for mythic that polar's revenge takes a lead on that one or work yeah they uh they took two rounds straight there to to get the advantage um canis to wrap this first half up uh, in a tie they're gonna have to get this out hank just needs a little warm-up uh, uh, apparently it took him a few rounds to get rolling but he is like rolling downhill right now you know when i was a kid once i rolled a boulder down a big hill and that's scary stuff and hank's reminding me of that boulder <laughs> it's like the big snowball you just you, you push it, it down bigger the hill, and bigger and it's just gonna keep on getting bigger and pretty soon you're not gonna be able to stop it that's kind of like my weight in my old age jeff <clears throat> mm-hmm That was a hell of an effort by DV8. Oh, huge. Like it, it looked so against him. 4v1 and was literally one bullet away from clutching that. Even had the shots <clears throat> on him. I mean, it was there. Oh God. If it was anybody but Hank, I bet you he would have had it. Yeah, Hank is on another level right now. Him and Mythic are hitting every shot. Some good drones placed here. It looked like four polars. So the Might last round? Some, oh, yeah, the last round of the first half. So yep. uh, if we come out of here 3-3, three, three, this is... I'm going to be furious. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid good games. Oh. It looks like they a couple guys looking downstairs. Who do we got? We don't have anybody on Rome. Canis this time around. Yeah, I don't know. It's actually uh, new. It's a little new to me. Next to those stairs, so he can probably rotate on those pretty quickly. Um, and it looks like Polar's really going to push underneath. They're going to work bottom to top here. So and you got Mythic and Light watching the stairwells. So, I, I mean, it makes sense. Yeah. Don't Mythic's going to get a late reinforce up. 
Uh, looks like they're gonna try to push up these stairs and light, light, waiting on them. He's got a lot more underneath him, and I don't know if he knows that, but they definitely know he's there now. His phone's just I, ringing so? off the hook. <laughs> they're taking the gamble Why? on that one with him oh, standing there. Bullets. Hank? Hank in a gunfight, too. Hold on a second. Oh, no, Hank. With a flick probably on his teammate. Light's getting pushed from main stairs here. All yeah, right. Hank takes out T. Oh, shots to the left. Oh, We're down to just by light. Triple kill for Light. Huge round for him. And Blunder, Blunder. gets her. <laughs> nice job. And that is all knotted up. I think they're doing this on purpose, Jeff. <laughs> Throwing <don't>... for views. <laughs> Throwing for content. They just don't want you to watch the Cowboys. That's all that really is. You know, there's some days where I don't want to watch the Cowboys. See you last year. All right. Well, <laughs> three to three Hank after half here. one. Hank over um, here calling out his 11 kills. I think a team kill does not count, Hank. <laughs> Hank, once he gets those flicks working, that aim's feeling good, anything that's in his vision is going to get shot in the head. Absolutely. Teammate uh, or not, he's flicking to it. On a serious note, though, you think he's going to pull back a little bit? Because you, you've been in the zone. You've been firing off, popping off, and then you get a little team killing. You're like, okay, hold on. I need to slow down a little bit. You think that's going to hurt <laughs> nah. him here? Nah. Shoot first, ask questions later. Captain Smoke Goyo. I don't know if that was meant to be all chat. Anyways. Oh, no, they can see. You can see what they're going with. I Yeah, that's what I was I'm wondering if they were trying to do a, a six pick. Ah. Uh, why would they do that if they're in voice chat? I don't know. These are all the hard questions in life. You never know. And yeah, wouldn't you believe it? We are on pace for another OT. We've played one half. And here we are. No advantage yet. So now we get to flip it up, though. Now Polars yep. is going to be on the defensive side. And it's always fun to see which team can adapt quicker. Or, you know, figure out. It's always been hard for me to flip that switch because it's a different game completely. When you're on the other side of the, you know, objective. You say it's that, just a but I play style. I can't play this game at all. <laughs> all right. Don't get like... banned, Nix. Don't get banned. We got ourselves a kidding. first little. <laughs> <laughs> so dirty right there. Hold on. Uh oh. Uh oh. Look at the feet. Oh, Look at the feet. You got a little movement. Little him. movement. Go. Oh. Oh, light. Light and Mac trading a couple rounds to each other. Yeah. Get a drone up inside of there. Let's take a look. I think that's going to stop everything for a little bit. I did for life baseball. Okay. That was a good joke. I appreciate that. Uh, it's the ice skating that makes it rough to watch. Yeah. The, uh, that, that whole encounter there reminded me, you know, of the two dogs just barking heavily at each other with a gate <laughs> in front of them. And then as soon as they move the gate. Uh, then the owner opens the gate and they're like, ah, well, you know what? I'm, I'm done with this. <laughs> this is not, this is not what <laughs> I want to do. I didn't sign up for this part of it. <laughs> oh, I just want to be, I just want to bark. <laughs> uh oh. Ooh, oh, Hank with that angle. You could see Even it happening. Even with the drone on him. Uh -oh. He almost used the drone to his advantage. Tiny Taco with a second and they're already up on numbers here. Take a look at Mythic here. Running out, light on the outside. Yep. Got a drone on Simon. Oh, 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 no. oh the bank shot. Uh-oh. And there's just a lot of smoke and no vision now here for Mythic. Just going to shoot in the dark. <laughs> That's oh, going to be tough. It's going to be tough. Pushing blindly through the smoke. It uh -oh. has dissipated now, though, so. What do we got? Oh, light just rotated. Oh, I'm Mythic missing to takes... everybody. 
Yeah, you switched off at just the just an instant light. Oh, it's, tiny taco ooh, gets SMG him. shot. Double kill for Taco. 38 seconds left. Yeah, Polar's hear the footsteps. working well here. Mythic has rotated. What nice a shot. shot. Another Whoa, one in piano. Triple. triple kill for Mythic. Take and a look now... at Tiny Taco. See where he's going. <laughs> I bet his <laughs> taco's taco. feeling pretty tiny right now. Oh, <laughs> uh, we got a top ping. the tacos. They do have some intel, it looks like. Like, just it's with not those bad. kings. Yeah. Where's Blunder at, though? I don't know, but Taco's about to get challenged. He he gets him, him down. Plants going Blunders down though. Planning. Oh no! Ah, uh, the plant gets the off. The plant went down on the and other side. Blunder. And Blunder takes him out. Oh, what a play! What? What a play by Canis right there. Mythic pushing into the the default. While that happened, Blunder rotated all the way back to Master, gets the plan off as uh, Mythic's taking that gunfight to smoke. And that's just good. That is just good communication. And talk about that time wasting, too. Got him stuck in a corner, wasn't able to do much. Yeah, good plays. Uh, it was just really good uh, communication. That, that has to be the only reason that that play happened. Communication. Number one. And Canis takes the first round of the second half, 4 3, with that late plant by Blunder and the kill after. It's good stuff. I'd tell you that I didn't expect that, but at this point, if I were to put money on it, Polar's going <laughs> to win this one. Every, it <laughs> seems every team that has the late edge, it flips immediately. It's just players making good plays right now, man. That's it. That's pro league for you. Woo. All right. What do we got going on here? Pretty typical holds there. Yeah. You remember this guy? The old piano. The old, piano, the old shield. piano shield. Piano shield. We've seen some plays behind that piano shield. Attackers are heading out to defuse a bomb. All right, it's go time. Some early shots right at the 250 mark. Yeah, I don't see where. Uh, hey, Taco. Okay, Taco, he's he's way oh, down serious. there. Looks like he's got a drone coming his way too. Mythic's gonna work from big garage over. Uh, unfortunately, the drone did not go his way, so that could be our first instance of a gunfight here. If Mythic chooses to push behind that drone, see what happens. I see no reason why he would choose not to. No, he's got clearance. As, as far as he knows, it's clear. Yep, and... he didn't look down that back hole, but we are uh, about. God, Ow. with no information. Oh my goodness, Mythic. This is dirty. Somebody get this man a towel. He's got to cool off. Get him some water. And you got light helping out on the other end. What do we got going for holds? Magdi's going to be hanging out on that shield. It looks like Canis is tough position they have... to be in. Mythic down, though. Oh. Nice kill That's by gonna be Simon pretty critical. There. Where are we at though? What's Mac well, D in a gunfight? Like Canis has uh, a couple of guys outside on balcony waiting for a default plant, depending on what happens. Yeah, on we the got push. a soft thing on the ground. And they oh, have the numbers. Coming from the side. Oh, what a shot by T. Just We're quick down to peek Simon? out on Mac D. Simon and Glitter Goose, the only two uh, polars left. Oh, oh, Simon with a huge C4. And that could change things for them. Oh. oh. T with a double kill so far Not this enough. round. Barely missing those shots. Glitter you Gooch. Got plant dropping down, though. And T with a triple kill. His best round of the match so far. Man, that's good stuff Janus from Lupus. T. Doing good That's on good the team. attack. 
<laughs> Let's talk tea. My son told me a good joke the other day, and oh, I think yeah? I need to share it. Speaking of tea, I love jokes. How come British people don't pronounce their teas? I don't know. Because they drink it all. <laughs> That's really good. <laughs> yeah, I thought really it good. was good. But nobody's drinking all of this tea. This tea's <laughs> here. And this is the biggest lead we've had today. Absolutely. This is huge. This is a huge lead. I mean, they're they're running this away a, with it. This is a monumental lead by Canis right here. <laughs> this is a, they're destroying their opponents. Actually, if you take a look at the kill spread, um, they they have a huge advantage. Canis Loop is playing out of their mind right now. They have had two really good rounds since the the half has gone into the second. They're they're. They are attacking very efficiently on this Absolutely. polar defense. And I, that whole scenario with Mythic's drone just completely not even seeing. Uh, I don't remember who that was. I think it may have been Taco. It was it was Tiny Taco sitting there just holding that oh, angle. My goodness. Coming in blind, just, does the flick shot and says, eh, you know, no big deal. It's a Sunday. God, that's just filth absolute filth all right we got a basement hold surprised we didn't see that first though they were holding Man, on to like, it this is it it looks like polars have chose to go on very objective extended here changing it up you got two people Mac on Rome you got tiny yeah, taco upstairs Mac D and actually Simon mid floor. There, I mean, they're I all over. I don't see the anyone place. in objective. Like, you got glitter gooch, glitter gooch near. Like, hey, glitter gooch, this is all on you. Hey, right, good luck. Uh, Wall's already going to get blown up here. Yeah. On the left side, they got the Maverick oh. right there. It looks like with the nade play to get rid glitter, of the wall I'd be denial. Oh, that was a risky peek. They didn't get the hatch and uh, connector either. Tough oh, shot. Mac, Mac D, D gets blunder. blunder up top. Yeah. So, so far the Rome game's working. Mac and D with a second. With a double. And Simon takes out Mythic. So the Rome heavy approach is showing some results. Taco oh. comes out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was... This is ridiculous. All right, who do we he got? got? He got one, though. Taco got and one, and Mac D with a triple. Mac D with a triple kill. Sorry, Roaming I'm so laughing about the body falling out of the sky. <laughs> oh, dirty shot, Mac D. The roaming rook play. You love to see it. <laughs> you got to pick the guy that's the fast. Oh, you got to pick the guy that's the bit. None of that makes sense. He went with the roaming rook. Roaming rook, when in doubt, just roam. Just grab some plates, roam it out, frag out. That's all. Mac just give someone Mac D can just frag out with, and he's golden. Now he's a gamer, man, a real gamer. Mac D's a gamer. Give me one second, like all right. I got a phone call. No, you got to do what you got to do. But well, we got our leaders, Mythic, Hang Cyclone. I think there's been a pretty Pretty common denominator, though. If you can get Mythic early, Light, T, I mean, those things, those guys have been critical and pivotal in this match. So we'll we'll see what happens here. Attackers need to locate and defuse bombs. Main floor hold. Back D on Rook again. This time we've got a Frost. That'll be interesting to see on those quick plays coming from Light and Mythic. All right. I am back. Sorry about that. That was a work call or else I would not have taken it. You're okay. We all have jobs. We all have lives. I was just pointing out that Tiny Taco is running Frost. Um, oh, Mac first on... Frost sighting of the day. Absolutely. I, I think it's to counter the, the quick action of Mythic and, and Light. They got a yeah. mid-ground hold. But I haven't seen anything crazy. 
also Clear. before the work phone call i was going to touch that that was a great answer by polars after dropping the two rounds in a row going down to the biggest deficit we've seen today but huge turnaround for polars and it was all it was very a very dominating performance early shots now i like the aruni gate on the window that gets rid yeah. of the ayana oh, oh tiny, tiny taco. taco where did that come from but tiny tacos down oh. from t i yeah, didn't even see that happening. trade that that developed quickly it sure did oh, oh t, t gets takes a second hank oh yeah. it, it looked like Canis Lupu. <laughs> yeah, well, oh, yeah. glitter answer. <laughs> Mythic low. Key. A lot of this is very Man, this aggressive. This is all here. over the place. Yeah, Canis is getting aggressive on this push. And Polars is down to their last two here Mac D and Glitter. Ooh, some shots. Mac D doesn't have any intel on where he's at, though. Oh, oh, I thought he got him, but life flips so to him close. as well. That was very close. I thought Mac D did enough there. Glitter's got to get the shots. To... Gets it. Takes down oh, light. Yeah. That's going to be pretty good. Mythic Great is shot. down. I don't know if anybody knows Mythic's down. I didn't even know Mythic was down. What the shot it's on Blunder? Actually, a 1v1. Diffuser's also down. Yep, here we go. Oh, no. Wrong way, oh! wrong way. No! Oh, blunder, blunder takes out glitter does not blunder on that one uh, not a blunder <laughs> on that play and gets the final kill on glitter and i don't know if they had the intel that mythic was down it was essentially a 1v1 <clears throat> good and try I, uh, that was a very good try and now we're on match point here for this is, uh Canis. this is match point this is this could be it yeah polars have to win two rounds in a row to force us to ot to get points out of this not gonna lie i love I, a good ot match i do love some ot but speaking we're of, unbiased we can't oh go ahead sorry speaking of what i was just gonna make another t joke oh go ahead i mean i think no, we all want to hear it, it no it was not good i bet it was amazing jeff just let it out Moving be on. you Moving just on. be you. Don't worry. <laughs> I was literally going to repeat your joke, but put O in front of it. <laughs> Man, I miss casting this game. Sorry for my departure for so long. It's like life. What? Yeah, it kind of gets in the way sometimes of the thing that is Broly. Yeah, unfortunately, it got. It interrupted my cast, even. Thanks, work. You're going to have that from time to time. Ah, it happens. All right. This could be the final hoedown, as some might say. Oh, bro down, maybe? Oh. Okay. All right. Bro down. Polar's revenge. Bro gotta, I got to say, well, I don't make what? those quick connections like you do, Jeff. <laughs> oh, damn. Uh, it made me laugh, so it was worth. <laughs> it's so all that worth. matters. It's all that matters. No, we're not here for the viewers. We're here to make our hear ourselves talk and make ourselves laugh. Hundred percent. What viewers? Am I right? Uh, yeah. Who cares about those guys? I'm just kidding. Bunch of jerks. Looks like T's gonna try to push this uh, library. Yep. Uh, not really paying any mind for uh, Polars. No, we got Hank down Hank below. Hank is but below, and he does right. have a C4. Okay, hold on. We got some action happening already. Yeah, big window hanging out over here. I don't know who that is, but Tiny Taco has a really good angle on it if they choose to peek it, and I could there see that happening. There's oh, that angle. It was on. light. Yep. Oh. Uh-oh. Taking away his cover. Oh, this is oh, very wow. brave is by Taco. Interesting. interesting. Let's see who's little. out. Coyote. Yeah, it's deviate out there. Oh, Simon goes down. Oh, that's not a good start. Mythic oh! Oh, popping off. Mythic just completely takes library by himself. 
gonna get rid of the Aruni gate and this is gonna be interesting like could this pay off tiny gets KO tiny oh gets my goodness with a prone play the Aruni <laughs> punches the first but now it's all up it's to 1v2 him. if it's gonna be anybody it's gonna be a tiny taco right here he's got I intel believe, I believe in this taco this is it taco is my favorite meal not going hungry tonight Camera's down. Oh, they know. Shots on him. Taco gets the with one. a triple, a triple kill. And he saw the he saw the last yeah, one. Yeah, he did. Diffuser is still down. And Taco kind of cards in his hand right now. I'm a little bit speechless. I don't even know what to say. This would be a clutch of all. Kind of breaking up on me and losing you. We're losing connection. Sorry, uh -oh. am I back? No, I'm, I think it was on my end. I like his gun skin. That's what I said. I did scoop it. Plants going down on the opposite side. Yeah, it's going to be they a tough one. do have intel. He's getting soft pings. Oh, this is a chess match, Lake. This is, I, this is oh, intense. Oh, this is very intense. 30 seconds to work. Oh, he gets in behind. Oh my God! Moves the moves. Well, he's got to move though. He's got to get it. He's got to get he's, that kill. He's got time. He's gonna. Is he gonna try to stick it? Oh no! no he gets no. the quad kill. Keeps pulling in it. <laughs> quad kill for Taco. What a clutch and what a play! Wow. Oh my God, Taco with the. Just, <laughs> oh my God, that was. What I don't play. even know what hey, to say. I, I said I believed. <laughs> I said tacos are my favorite meal. Same uh, thing. <laughs> oh my goodness, taco. What a play. And we continue to go on. Oh, we get a little chat stuff there uh talking about teams next year. Keep keep yeah, uh, yeah. keep an eye on what's going on. We might be doing a little change up. Might be individual, might be draft, and it might be bringing in whole yet. teams. We we play. We this make is the only rules season, up as we go. <laughs> it's only season two of Bro League, but yeah, stay tuned. We are we are listening to the players and viewers. That's for sure. It's a it's a pretty chill league, so no one can just bring their their whole team in. It, we did this season on a draft with whoever we had signed up at the time. And I don't know what we're going to do next year, but if you want to be involved, if you like what's going on, fill out the application so you can be involved in season three of Broly, because we are already on that second half of the season this year. So if you'd like to fill in as a sub, possibly, fill that app yeah. out. And community's pretty active, too. So if you get into yeah. our chats, there's a lot of pickup matches. A lot matches. of custom 10 mans yeah. going on. A lot of ranked play with the guys with everybody in the league everybody's involved it's a good community i i'll have to say one of the best communities i've ever been a part of yeah it's actually pretty mind-blowing it's turned out to be pretty wholesome yeah speaking of wholesome what tiny taco did that round was holy not cow that, that was, was just <laughs> that was criminal <sighs> what a play Good stuff by Taco. Absolutely. You know what? Kept him in the match though. One more, one more win oh, by yeah, Polar's Revenge, and it was like a clutch play in itself. But the clutch factor was compounded so much by where we are on on the points for the match. Crazy. All right, Tiny Taco on the roam, coming off of that round. I I agree. Everybody, everybody knows Tony Taco. <laughs> Tony, did I say Tony Taco? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> Don't, it's great. They're great. <laughs> if he gets challenged on that window, he's he's got a kill guaranteed. I don't know why they look would, like though. anybody's going up there. I don't think they can actually get on that window. Oh, they can. They can. Yeah. <clears throat> We got some shots going off inside. Let's take a look. And no one's really come upstairs to challenge Taco. Oh, so we got Simon drones galore. Light. Entry frag for the Polars. So numbers in their favor early. 
Oh, got T the kill is and down. He's going back. Oh, this is not We're looking. Oh, the wall is open, and what? I don't think that information got to Simon. A lot of back and forth right here. It was, yeah. <laughs> Polar's got the first two, but it was answered right back by Canis. Oh, right when taco. I taco. <laughs> He's <laughs> as greasy as ever. Oh, oh my God! What? Tiny Taco, and we're doing it. We're, we're going we're into it. overtime. Tiny Taco <laughs> single-handedly makes sure that we. Jeff and Blake are going to overtime on this one. Forget we didn't the teams. Get to see this is it. about us. But Mac D did get a kill simultaneously as Tiny Taco did. Both headshots. We only got to see the one. But oh my goodness, Lake. What our ratio of OT games is insane. It is. <laughs> it is just insane. I don't understand. I'm laughing it. about it. This is this is exciting. Good game, man. It's <laughs> it's I, I sound like John Madden. I'm, I'm literally like, <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh boy, uh, this. I'm speechless, Look, Jeff. I I don't know what to say. Like it's literally almost every time we cast a match, this is what happens, and I don't understand what it is. It's because is there communic it's, it has is there communication to do behind our backs. <laughs> No, it has nothing like, to do with us. Is it insider it is, trading? Is a true testament to the equality that is Bro League and how well the teams are composed. Just unbelievable. <laughs> they hate us because they cane us. Attackers need to locate and Absolutely. Oh, All boy. Right. Cane us on the attack. Last time we saw that, Mythic popped off like crazy. Midnight did call the OT. I will give her credit for that. She called it very early. I believe I it was mean, like 2 2. I'm just going to say that. it. We called it just by being uh, the casters. Uh, yeah. I mean, you, it's, you're, <laughs> you're not getting the same odds when we're casting it. You know, normally it'd be probably like a 12 to 1, but when you and I are casting, it's more like a 3 to 1 odds yeah, on an OT match. It's, it is insane. I'll tell you what though, that it makes it fun to cast. I enjoy it. Oh, I'm glad we get 100%. to see such good games. Hopefully I get to see a good one at 325 as well. And it's gonna be bad. I hope not. I mean I hope it is bad in the fact that my, my boys handle business. Okay. All right. <clears throat> So we're, everybody's getting set up. Hank's on the room with the Intel Valk play. I'm surprised we haven't seen more Valk on the board with her available. Absolutely. To be honest. Uh, it's just such an OP operator if you have good cam spots. It's going to be good, though. With... Out. They did drone Hank out below. He just shot one. Take a look. Oh, he saved one. Interesting. MACD's also yep. below. Well, they got a soft ping on that door. Oh, Drone down. He's about to get some company. Another drone. Twitch All just has drones. the most drones. They're gonna. They're definitely pushing this big garage for sure. I'm trying to see where they're at though. Light oh, they're coming in this big garage. Yeah, light is pushed in a garage. Coyote is set up in uh. I think we're about to see and blunders. Some... Wonder has Diffuse waiting on stuff to happen for a plan. Shots and down. Hank. Hank is down. Deviate with a great shot on Hank, and Hank is a good one to take out here early. Uh, he has had a hot hand today. Light has slowly pushed in from Big Garage here, but this is a great... Great job. It, you can tell it's OT late. You can tell the yeah, change everybody's... of play. Everybody's it's moving real very, slow, it's but it's all going to collapse. Yeah, 100%. I'm, I'm waiting to see. We got the pings. We got everything going on. Yeah, Mythic's point. He's, he's set up to push down these stairs. They have. And there it was. Yep, there it is. Takes out Glitter Gooch, and now they have numbers, and he is going to be waiting on some intel probably. A lot of comms happening right now. He's got one on his uh, 90 here on Blue Hall. 
I don't know if he knows it. And if they swing him, and they yeah, do, oh, Mythic swings I flipped him. off. Yeah, Mythic swung on him, takes out, or I'm sorry, Simon's Max D. whip by Mac D. Oh my God. Simon, Simon gets comes a second. back, changes everything. Oh. Mac D with a huge headshot. Whoa. Light trades it. It's a 1v1. We got the tiny Light. taco show. Yeah, taco versus light. And However, he's going to be in the right oh, spot at the right time. Polar's taco. Revenge comes back and takes the lead. Huge play by Taco. They did not have Diffuser in the 1v1, and that is what cost them that one. Had light had Diffuser, he could have easily planted in cellar and wine. But that's just the, it's the nature of the beast. I don't even know what to say about Taco right now. I mean, I get it. He didn't do all the work, okay? But he's no, been there absolutely at the not. right spot at the right time, playing out of his mind. 16 kills. Yeah, 16 for Taco, 11. I mean, it's been a team effort. Look at these kill spreads. Oh, my God. Just so much, so much death. This is match point. Polar's Revenge can take the win here. And as a reminder, there is no tie games. So no, there is a no team going to win. If Canis happens to win this match, we will play one more round. Uh, the good news for both of these teams is they will both leave with some, some points. Any OT win is worth two, and any OT loss, you get a point. So it, we, we made that rule change this year based off of how the Pro League does their stuff, their scoring, because it doesn't make much sense for a team to lose all points if they force an OT. You know, like that, that values a 7 0 loss the same as an 8 6 loss or an 8 7. Doesn't make much sense. It's a lot of work for nothing. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You should get something. If you force a to OT, you get a point, no matter what. I want a participation trophy, Jeff. <laughs> well, Where's we don't the give those out. Where? Only one team gets to take home the Bro League Major Trophy. And uh, had you sought out last season, you might would have got one. Uh, uh, I don't think I would have. Not gonna lie, the team makeup <laughs> was a lot better without me. Yeah, you gotta be. Uh, shout out to Pablo on that one. Absolutely. You got, uh, got the nod up to the to the majors with you, <laughs> with your uh, departure, which I think it's worked out very well. I do have to say. Yeah. Pablo has found a home in the Bro League. I think I you like agree. <clears throat> All right, we got T setting up and shots going off behind him right now. Yeah, at OT rules, both teams have switched now. Like, there, there's no one team going to defend everything. So we've switched it up. Canis is now on the defensive side. Uh, it sounds like Pablos doesn't play Siege anymore. He may be in a new world. Yeah. It could be a new world has opened up for Pablo. <laughs> Taco's hanging out on this big window here, and he's not really getting challenged. That's a tough fight to take on the defensive side. So good job not taking that fight, honestly. It seems like it would be an easy one to win, I do have to say. Blunder's down. Yeah, clear goose gets the entry early. on on blunder. Um, however, they have mythic playing in piano, and he's and this, he's gonna have a lot of company. Ink is Light down. Evens it up. Oof. Oh god, I'm nervous. Somebody right outside the window. <laughs> Not that Tiny one. Tiny Taco, Taco does get one. He waited patiently. Simon gets one. We're down to mythic. Taco oh, tries Taco's to come in, but uh, down. We're down to mythic. <laughs> And Mythic's timing is just uncanny, like. Trying to get that Aruni gate back up. Oh my goodness. He we shoots. Don't. <laughs> we, don't, we, we don't talk about that. No. He's got one. He's got two on his window. One's pushing Solarium. So they've, Out they've completely reconstructed their push. Polar. What a Another kill. Another kill by Mythic. Man, it looked like he was going to get a third. The last two colors are on that window, like. 
2v2. Mythic and Deviate versus MACD and Glitter Goose. 30 seconds to go and they're repositioning themselves. This is going to be tough. Mythic's in a good spot. Oh, oh that's deadly. Mac How did that got not him. hit? Ping's on him and Mythic gets it. Oh, Mythic with the C4 down didn't get the kill. And that was kind of confusing. <laughs> if you're uh. watching, um, you don't get notifications in this league when you're down someone like that and i think they changed that in the actual game now too which is good it's a good change look at these kills 21 21 for mythic and for 13 seven, for seven. and we're going until this is it this is put up or shut up this is the last round of this match is it winner take all at this point or not even all <sighs> winner take two points winner take two winner take two this has been this might be the best match of the season so far absolutely it, it's been insane what a day for it to happen what a day <laughs> what a day what time do your cowboys start <laughs> couldn't tell you 325 i believe <laughs> but you know we should be all right all right and what I, do we got going I'll on i'll mention here? again like i'll mention again i want to hear it how crucial this match is. Both teams are two and two in the challenger division. Polars are up one point on Canis. So if Canis pulls this out, both teams are tied at seven points. Oh. And they're tied for third place, essentially. So oh, pretty, no. pretty big match for seeding purposes so far in and the challenger right division. Here. I mean, it comes down to this. This is the last time these two teams will play this season, unless they meet in the playoffs. All right. Mac D upstairs. Tiny Taco. <sighs> He's the one to look out for. That hot hand for Taco. <laughs> I don't know why that sounded funny, but I like it. <laughs> uh oh. We got some conversation. Now is not the time for issues. Hasn't started yet. Awesome. Good to hear. All right, where do we got? We got light and T. Mythic coming down. Remain. Oh, yeah, yeah. Balcony. Coyote might run into Glitter Gooch here on that window if he challenges it. I don't think he is. He's going to go up top. Okay. I was trying to help the cameraman out. No, I appreciate it. There's a lot happening right now, and I'm, my eyeballs are all over the place. And I don't know who to go to. You have Light and T on Balcony right now. Blunder over there on uh, Library Push has a drone on someone. Didn't catch who that was. But they're pushing into Balcony Window. Light has pink. dropped. Yeah, he's got, info, he's got info over here. He does know there's one kitchen side. But it looks like they went down West Main Stairs. So he's just going to hold that. Look out for that Mozzie. That's Simon down there. He did go down. He could come back up behind light if he chooses to. Simon is creeping up. Not really about to run into anyone. Oh, and a drone drops right down in front of him. <laughs> Amazing timing. All right. Where is this action? Where is it going to happen? Everybody's posturing at this point. Yeah, this is... Uh, we, we've got two minutes now, and there has not been any guns gunfights whatsoever. Can you tell? It's winner. Winner go Simon's here. down. A light takes oh. Simon down. That gives them the advantage. Canis Lupus. That. Polars are playing very conservative here. Simon gets taken out on the roam. Starting to get aggressive. 48 seconds yeah. remaining. I mean, Drone's we're going about... down. I don't... There's a drone watching the rotate up. Mythic Glitter misses the shot. Takes down Glitter Mythic. Gooch. T down. I don't know who Hank. took T down. Hank Cyclone. Polars have uh, just got two real quick and have taken the advantage now in the match. Tough position Ace to be in. Charge. A charge going out on balcony, and it's gonna come down to this. Light, Light gets takes Hank. Out Hank. 
and he's got the wall 12 blown. seconds to go they don't have time on their side they Actually, have to get a plant down i don't know who's got, got in. he's deviate. got coyotes in oh my god like plants Shots going down, down. it's oh, oh, Mac D lands in for polar's revenge Mac D stops the plant from piano and they get the ot win eight seven Good positioning by MACD. Great game by Polar's Revenge. Excellent play by both teams. Oh my God. Holy cow. What a match. MACD is just prone in piano with the footholds. Oh my God. MACD with 10, Woo. Hank with 12, Taco with 17. What a game. Man, Jeff. If they could oh. all be this good, I think we'd have more viewers. <laughs> like they all have. <laughs> That's right. Broly came out full force tonight. Literally every, every match we cast is just a freaking barn burner. I don't even know what to My say. My God. I can tell you this. That puts Polars. That gives them eight points solely in third by themselves canis will get the one point they're now at six points on the season in fourth place for the playoffs so as of right now polars are in canis is out of the major and that's the first loss for canis in three weeks they won two straight coming in polars rebounds gets right back in it with the win it says a Man, lot it says a lot, a lot of for parody. polars so much parody in this league this year like it's been a lot of fun it's been it's been good to watch and i mean we're only week six is down we're starting week seven yeah, we got three more weeks the, before we get into the majors yeah we're going into week seven this was the last week six match so get your game scheduled guys please show up schedule it when everyone can be there more than likely if you can but yeah uh my god what a way to I'm, cap it off man <laughs> that was a hell of a match I it was a hell of a match I, I for those that watched all the way through we appreciate you um we're we're here for you guys but stay tuned for more more bro league action oh yeah just i mean if they're all like that why would you not come back that was just amazing entertainment good shit. i agree but until next time this is Broly.